one of the many dry lake beds of the Southern California desert. An interesting place to test the all new Golf R Mark VIII. Now, as you may know, every R model vehicle sold in the US is all wheel drive. And it is a very enhanced system with a torque vectoring system you may have heard me talking about. It is something that is incredible on the racetrack, making this 19 seconds faster than the Mark 7 around the Nürburgring. But on a slippery surface like this, you can really feel the advantage of the torque vectoring. This is science. This is not fun. I may laugh or giggle, but that is part of the science. So just keep that in mind. We are doing hard science here. Out on the dry lake bed where the grip is low and where it's very easy to slide, you literally can turn the steering wheel, hit the gas, and let's see what happens. The torque goes to the outside rear tire, and around we go. Into our own dust cloud, and it's officially dirty. That's the torque vectoring system working, powering the outside tire, like paddling on the outside of a canoe to turn it. But where it really pays off is once you get up to speed, the stability is unbelievable. So I'll go on the screen, boom, drift mode is activated. The stability control system is on and the torque vectoring is maximized for drifting. We'll go into second gear, we'll keep the steering wheel turned and just hit the gas. Sending power to the outside, but then the ESC system maintains this angle. I just sit here with my foot on the gas and it's just maintaining a very specific drift angle. We are drift king with hardly any experience. We can transition. Big, big drifts. Now let's do it ourselves. Uh, let's go ahead and turn the stability control system completely off. Now we'll do the same thing and now we'll monitor the slip angle ourselves. Feel it turns the car. But even like this, the torque vectoring is so good that it just keeps the car pretty balanced in a nice easy drift. It's just bizarre. It just defies the laws of physics that you can just turn the wheel, hit the throttle, and kick an all-wheel drive car into a drift. The torque vectoring really makes you feel like you're a better driver than you are. But let's go get some speed. for joining me on this little science experiment. Hopefully it was as pure science and not fun for you as it was for me. I do have 70 miles of fuel left, so I'm gonna go study a little bit more. Volkswagen.